video is for our half moon pose. Okay, it's a pose working strength on the lower body and opens up into the hips. Right, the stance is nice and wide. If you were coming out of triangle, let's say you had that left foot pointed that direction, your toes and heels are in a straight line, meaning when the toes and heels are straight line, your heels not over here. Okay, foot's not shifted. You're a nice straight line, heel to toe on that one foot, okay? We're gonna set here. I'm gonna use a block instead of the ground. If we were in our triangle, right? Came in, if you came from a, from a triangle pose, we would bend that knee, place the hand onto the block. Again, keep that straight line from the heel to the toes. You're going to open up this left hip as you straighten out that Good, there you go, there you go. Good, 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 good. Top hip opens. Avoid, what happens is that bottom foot wants to switch. So open up. Now again, imagine your switch between the panes of glass. Nice, eyes were comfortable. If you're next to a wall, place your hand on the wall. Allow yourself to open up that hip. Perfect, use your breath. Nice, and then gently release down. Shake out that leg. Position. Again, you can use a chair for balance if you have any kind of other prop around for balance. Take that stance wide. Pivot, right foot. Toe and heel in a straight line. Soften. Reach down, either for a block. You can balance something that's a little taller. As you straighten out, that bottom leg, Ooh, don't want to lose your balance, open up that hip, perfect, use that breath, <sighs> avoid that uh, foot shifting, we want to keep the foot nice and grounded into that mat, and then gently release it, perfect, all right, again, working on stability of the lower body, opening up that outside hip, yeah, adding that rotation. Hey, thank you.